on the show. Ugh. Sorry. Can you please calm down? Today on the show, a steak and guac, not a burrito, a wrap from Subway, because they got wraps. We did the chicken one recently. We're headed back for the steak one. See if it's any better, see if it's any worse. See you guys there. Oh, yeah. Smoky steak and guac wraps from Subway have been acquired. Eat fresh, jump caught. Bang! You are gonna feel the bang! Bang! What do you got? Our Lady Peace? Our Lady Peace, baby! I'll be waving my hand, watching you drown. Oh! This is a Corey Wagner second angle. I have never, and I'm dead serious, never had steak from Subway. I didn't like the steak from Taco Bell. I don't think I'm a big fan of Taco Bell steak. No. It's a little chewy, yeah. it's very small, like little, like blah, blah, blah. How does it stack up against Subways? Have I had it? I never had What's steak. What's that? Isn't there like a Chinese type thing they got there? Like a Mongolian beef? No. Or like a, a, a sweet and, uh, yeah, like a sweet and sour, sweet, sweet onion. Sweet sour steak. Sweet onion. Oh, sweet onion chicken, chicken teriyaki. teriyaki. Chicken teriyaki, mm. yeah, I haven't either. <laughs> <laughs> this is a second angle go! All right, but there's something about the orange tinted mm -hmm. wraps that mm -hmm. I just like better. Is that sun-dried tomatoes? What is, what is I that? I think so. Oh. But I'm not, I don't know, honestly. I don't know. Uh, also looking mushy, steak's probably better as a mushy object than chicken is. Yeah. You can see a little bit of the guac in there. That saw. <laughs> I smell a little like, it smells like salsa. I kind of okay. dig it. Yeah. But I haven't tried it yet. We also got some onions, green peppers, I think. Maybe banana peppers. I don't remember, but we got food on Onion, it too. yeah, green, uh, banana pepper. I also, we had the chi the new chicken one recently, and it was very, like, out of the can moist uh, texture. I'm hoping that's not the same with the steak. I'm praying. But you know what? I think there's a theme. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you yelling at, lady? Ready? Oh, there it is. There's a kid. I saw her turn and go, hey, he's got the same haircut as you. Oh, he does. <laughs> Holy smokes. All right, a steak and guac wrap from Subway. Let us know below if you've tried it. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. I'll be honest. From a pure sound effects part, mm. when we both bit that, there was a lot of this. Mm -hmm. And that makes me sad to lose the subscribers. Very juicy. Or gain subscribers if there's some ASMR guys right, coming in for, yeah, the, mm -hmm. for the juicy chews. <laughs> the juicy chews. I think way better flavor. Way better than the chicken. Mm -hmm. First bite in. It also, the banana pepper accentuates steak in this regard somehow better. Mm -hmm. I'm tasting the like spice a little more from that. And I'm like honestly soft, more bro. okay with like a, a softer steak. steak. Oh yeah. Yeah. I'm right there with you. Mm -hmm. I don't think you can do shredded steak, right? Correct. This is good. That sauce is good. This is the part of the show where we have Corey pronounce words. All right. Corey, start with the word sweet and tell him what kind of sauce is on this baby. Oh, Galileo. A sweet... Discovered the world and also made this sauce. A sweet Galileo... And what's, that, what's that word? Oh, mesquite. Galileo mesquite sauce. Cr creamy guac. Tomato basil wrap. So not mm. sun-dried tomato, but it is tomato basil. And the standard one comes with jalapeno uh. and Monterey cheddar cheese. That mailman's spitting in front of me. You see that? No, I was looking down at the dumb phone. Ugh. Gross. Gross! Uh, one of these wraps is, so we split it, so we're both having 345 calories, which is pretty good. That's not too bad, although I must say, their cutting skills. Rough. <laughs> We're definitely not both eating half of this. This is like, there was like a one quarter and a three quarters. 500 calories and 100 calories. Yeah, yeah. That was much better. Yeah. I still don't think it would be my go-to at Subway though. I still think there's like a significant amount of items that I would like be about before I'd eat that. Stay tuned after the uh, the end of the show, we're gonna open a package. Oh yeah. I don't know, man. I don't know either. And it's we're paid to know, so I'm worried. Oh boy. <laughs> Our jobs are on the line. Mm -hmm. Patreon shout out, Patreon shout out, Patreon shout out. Corey, what's Patreon? Patreon is a monthly subscription service that allows you to support our amazing and awesome videos. If you think these 25 or so videos a month is worth a dollar of your hard-earned cash, be a gentleman and give that right over, please, kindly. Quick math, if somebody donated a dollar a month and we put out 24 videos a month, oh, how much money is it per video that you're spending? That's like four cents, bro. That's four cents, bro. Patreon name number one. Alrighty, this wonderful human being and or conglomerate that has been supporting us on Patreon is called Wonder Media. 
doubt that's a name, but I think it's a thing. I've changed my clapping since I've been out of there. Ooh, Whoa. standoff. Three small dogs versus one big dog. That dog wants to play with them so bad. What's those two small ones called? I like those, the black ones. Miniature those, schnauzers. Ooh, maybe miniature schnauzer, that sounds right. Dude, that also, by the way, that woman on the left, mm -hmm. longest coat in the world. It's very long coat. Your coat shouldn't drag on the ground. Uh-uh, uh-uh. <laughs> My girlfriend has a coat, it's like a North Face that goes down to her boots. I'm like, how much yep. was that? Kylie's got a coat just like that ladies, except less fancy looking. About to have some Michael Vick action going down right now. <laughs> These people are going to prison. It's right. And they will then come back and play quarterback for who, the Eagles? <laughs> yeah, I think so. <laughs> Patreon name number two, Miss Tiffany Mighton. My ton? My ton. My ton. Tiff, 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 tiff. Yeah. <laughs> I'm back to my old ways. Oh, we're getting another dog into the mix. He's like, bro, let oh, me come that, and party. That dog would f those dogs. Let me come and party. Up. Look at the, dude, this, this is one reason why when I used to live up here, it was hilarious taking Lionel for a walk, because they have to just so ping dogs. pong across the street, because there'd just be like, rot yeah. and I'm like, oh, I'm gonna go die over there. Out of five. It's funny, that's why you ping pong. I do it to avoid human contact. You do it to <laughs> avoid dog contact. <laughs> That's so funny. It's a dry cleaner van. That whole back of that van's filled with dry cleaning clothes. You know what I'm saying? That's creepy. <laughs> Out of five DDP yoga logos, how many DDP yoga logos do you give the steak and guac wrap on that s tomato bays bread? <laughs> Corey. Well, I wouldn't say it was bad, but I also wouldn't say it was good. Yeah. So I think it, since it's landing right in the middle, I'm going to have to give it a nice middle score. It's a little bit better than the, the previous item that we tried, but it's barely. It's a two and a half or in my book. Yeah. Um, because I gave the other one a 2.5 middle of the road, I think this is better, but not much better. I'm going to give it a 2.8. Ooh, wow. I thought you were going to go 2.6, honestly. Hmm. We continue to surprise each other even after all these <laughs> years, Mary. <laughs> Are these two a couple? Guys, thank you so much for watching yet again another episode. I'm going to go ahead and just like throw in the bumper. Now we're going to open this package because that's how we do things oh, around yeah, here. We've got a package. I'm going to hit the lens, but you're going to stick around. Bro, I love that the weather's warming up, the amount of freaks we got out walking, dude. Bunch of dogs, this bearded pajama man. There is all kinds of greatness going on today in Chicago. Speaking of greatness. Oh, yeah. I point out three reasons why this is the coolest package ever. One, some of the coolest packaging we've ever seen. Two, professionally printed labels. Three, the labels are framed in melted cheese. It's a cheesy sixer if I've ever seen one. That was so good, I want you to open that. Oh, thank you. Let's clap Sean, he's great. He has to tell himself. You can't clap yourself! Yep, I know. <laughs> <laughs> Sunglasses on. Right, right. I look like I'm about to go to a beach party. You a bad A in those. Aggressive on the, oh there we go, I found a tape hole. T.O. Come on. Wait, T.H. I'm Come so on. bad at life. Well, O's, well, hole makes an O, so. <laughs> Thank you so much for defending me. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Nice hair, you freak. That lady. Huh, the nerve I have. Just ripping to people say nice with bad hair. Hairs. Yeah, you, you dick. freak. And we have the same hair, basically. There was a kid that walked by with the same hair as you. I want, to, I want him. To, I want to do a paternity test on that child. <laughs> That's mine, my boy. Whoa, is getting this? caught up on my tax while he does this. Okay, shirts, baby boy. Whoa. Ooh, it's that fresh mustardy Whoa. smell. I used to get new shirts like mailed to me all the time. Oh yeah. Well, this is nothing but me. Oh, a pizza shirt. Imagine two lunatics oh, walking around gosh. in public with these matching. Now I have four pizza shirts, and I'm not in the mindset that that's enough. Got some business cards. Lily Bomb. Look at the logo. You want a speed read or a good read? Give me a good read because it's not that long. Hey, Sean and Corey, I'm a big fan. I wanted to send you a pizza shirt. Hopefully, you can get in Sean's pizza shirt rotation. Hey. Couldn't leave Corey out, so I sent him a pizza shirt too. Thank you, buddy. I have a little shirt brand. I've started called Lily Bomb. Go on the site, lilybomb.com, and tell me some designs you like, and I'll send you a few. Keep doing your thing, you killing it, or you killing it. Chris K. Show him that note. Melted cheese. Dude, how long have you cheese been doing video? <laughs> I can't see it once it's over here. There it is, check it out. <laughs> I'm an idiot, I'm an idiot. I mean, unbelievable. Chris Kent, I think you get the award for like the best stationery. Yeah, stationery, 100p. And then just, this was just a very thoughtful, awesome gift it of you. It sure was. I will be wearing this on an upcoming pizza review. We uh, do a lot of pizza reviews on our Friday videos, so this would be a great Friday shirt. Yeah, it would. Is this, this neighbor has more dogs I than humans. I know, it's like a giant cinnamon on the left. It's like a bigger, like, 
face is a little different, but it's kind of like a huge Pomeranian. Yeah. That other one on the right, I don't know what it is, but it's beautiful. I love dogs, dude. If you guys want to mail us anything, that is Another the address. Another one! Clark Street, goes to a P.O. Box, we pick it up, it's safe. What a pretty girl. Dude, the oh, sun comes God, out, and these dogs, dude, I also, before noon today, I already took Lila on two walks. Oh, that little bitch cinnamon. She spoiled rotten now that I'm home all day. She comes up every hour. I took her out an hour ago and she comes up looking all cute and I can't resist her because she's so gosh darn cute. I've taken her out three times today before before you even got there, dude. You had to one-up me. Uh, no, it's cinnamon's little bitch ass. I was coming <laughs> up begging all the time. Now Kylie hates it because now she begs way more than before when I was home all the time. I spoiled her. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, if you're a dog fan, plus one to you. Give yourself a point. We'll see you tomorrow for a brand new video. Good things.